Hey, Steve Mignani here at High Octane Classics in Auburn, Massachusetts with a really cool American Motors project or product. This is a 1969 AMX. First year for the AMX, which you probably know is a Javelin minus nearly a foot of wheelbase and turned into a two-seater. This was a very unique pony car. Now this one here represents in Big Bad Orange, which was uh, an American Motors optional color. The original color on this car was red, but that said, it's got some greatest hits goodies added to it, including the Go Pack Stripe over the roof, the Group 19 front spoiler, and at the rear there's also a ducktail spoiler. We'll get to that in a few. Uh, but under the hood, and speaking of that hood, by the way, AMXs have a really special hood with these sort of uh, raised bumps. Not seen on Javelins, very rare. This is not fiberglass, this is an actual steel AMX hood rare stuff. Uh, fiberglass replicas are about as good as it gets if you don't have the real thing, but this is the real thing. Okay, let's look underneath the hood and see what we have. Nice. Okay, now this is an AMC V8, not an LS, not a Chevy small block. We know that because the distributor's up front where it belongs on an AMC. Uh, it has Edelbrock Performer RPM aluminum heads. Good to see that. Aluminum uh, dual plane Edelbrock intake manifold, RPM air gap with an Edelbrock four barrel carburetor. Power steering up front. Looks like an MSD type distributor. Power disc brakes up front with a Summit uh, high energy ignition system. Huge Griffin cross flow radiator with twin cooling fans. So this is something that's been sorted out and dialed in and ready for daily driving and you know, some spirited use at the drag strip or maybe even the, the road race course. Now on AMC products, here we can see, this is the VIN tag. And we look at this, A, American Motors, 8, 1968 model year, M, factory four speed car, when born, X390. Now keep in mind the AMX was available with three engines in 1968, the 290, the 343 or the Big Dog 390, which is what this has. Although this one has been overboard to 401 cubic inches, but pretty peppy stuff going on right here. Now, something I love on this one are the day two wheels. These are American Racing torque thrusts up front, 15 by seven or eight. Uh, front and rear, same size with Cooper Cobra radials. And here, these are the side pipes. These are called Sidewinders, and these were sold to American Motors by a company called Trendsetter Industries. These side pipes were available at AMC dealers, part of the Group 15 Accessory Package Group, and these are real functional side pipes. Now, the thing to keep in mind is that, like the Corvette, the two-seat Corvette, the AMX was the other only two-seat sports car sold in America in the 1960s. So inside, we'll take a peek, and uh, again, no back seat in the AMX. These are strictly uh, two-seaters, they're sports cars. Aftermarket racing seats up front, aftermarket wheel, gauges, and just nicely done up front. And uh, an interesting detail, too, is the factory four-speed's been replaced with a five-speed, and the beauty there, of course, is overdrive. So when you hit the highway, uh, the engine tames down, you save fuel, save the engine for a good long time, and uh, potentially top speed you know, on a closed course <laughs> is uh, a lot higher with an overdrive in uh, fifth gear. The rear axle on this one is a Model 20 AMC, which is the heavy duty piece, which is what you want to see. And uh, here again is that Group 19 deck spoiler. And again, the Go Pack stripe over the top. Go Pack, of course, was a power or performance option, which included limited slip and all the other goodies. Uh, and again, this car was originally red. We know that by looking in the trunk and seeing the traces of the original red paint on the floor. Speaking of, that is the original trunk floor. There's no rust on this one. It's a very solid body. Uh, the insides of the quarter panel show the factory applied dum dum that mud, but that is nice Kenosha, Wisconsin steel. And of course, Kenosha, Wisconsin is where the AMX and the Javelin and the Matador and the Pacer and the Gremlin were all built when AMC was at, uh, at the height of its powers. So that's the story of this 1968 AMC AMX, not a Javelin, 401 five speed manual. Uh, Model 20 rear axle, nice day two touch-ups on this one. And uh, keep in mind that High Octane Classics does finance with as little as 10% down. They'll also deliver the car to your door if you choose, and they take trades. They'll consider late models, daily drivers, classics, you name it, they'll, they'll consider it. So if you want to learn more about this great 1968 AMX, go to the High Octane Classics website.